Shrapnel lay discarded on the casualties, their nerves still twitching. Troops dived into trenches as bullets whistled over them. Take cover, they cried, as bodies spouted blood from their wounds and screamed in terror of death. Rotting flesh polluted the air, made the troops gag as they sat red-eyed in the trenches. Fires burnt inside the men. Some were kindled by anger and hatred. Some were stoked by fear and sadness. As he lay in the trenches, he dreamt of the sweet buttery caramels his grandma made. Her face crinkled and loving as she stirred the sugary mixture. He saw his sister as she played happily in the hay bales of their farm her plaits flashing wildly around her shoulders. He smiled as he remembered his uncle, taking him and his brothers for a drive in the family's first motor car, watching the world whiz by as they sped through the country lanes. He inhaled the smell of leather as he polished his gun holster and remembered old Bess, the family's workhorse, the smell of her tack as he would scrape the day's sweat from her bridle how she would whinny with delight when his younger brother would scratch her chin. He sighed. When would he hear from home? <laughs> 